Hey, yeah, you. Hey, I appreciate y'all stopping by and watching the video. I really do. Hey, you like what you see? Hit that like button, baby. And you know what? You should subscribe too. That's free. Everybody loves free. That's free 99, baby. Hit that subscribe button. And if you want to see me live, check out my Twitch channel. Give me a follow. We have fun over there, baby. You can have fun too. Let's do this. Hey, no fall damage. Oh, I love it. I love no fall damage. Oh, that's so excellent. Keep this shit quick. <laughs> well, that no fall damage. Over here. Lady Ibba. Oh, wait, I guess we gotta talk to you. Oh, Link, I am so pleased that you come here as well. To be honest, Lady Impa deduced that there is something related to the geoglyph here. It took some effort for us to get up here, but we managed it. But then Lady Impa grew impatient. The moment I took my eyes off her, she went deep into the temple all by herself. Once I finish mooring the balloon, I plan to hurry after her. Look at that. So she went further in. Do I need to fight them? There's a shrine in the oh shit. Motherfucker throwing rocks. Come on, there's gotta be a sweet spot. Zimpa right there. Just activate it. And I'm up. I know what I probably would do is probably activate all the shrines I come across, and then all in one go, just do them all. Thank you again for your help with the balloon. I believe there is something related to the geoglyph somewhere within this temple. I am searching, but so far it has been in vain. The chamber here are enormous, so it will be difficult tasks at best. Where could it be? Where could it be? I am trying my hardest. And I cannot find my way. Where could it be? Hold on, what is this? What is this? That looks like that might be something. Ah. Ah, this place. Lady Impa, 
Let's head down. We must investigate up close. Oh. Oh, thank you. There upon the walls. Are those not geoglyphs? Hmm. What could this mean? Hmm. I believe the one we saw first was the geoglyph on the left edge of the wall. As for the next painting, mm -hmm. according to the floor map, it is near Rito Village. Ooh. It seems the location of the map, uh, it seems like the location of the other geoglyph from the walls are marked on the floor map as well. Yeah. I can hardly believe what my eyes behold. Who could have guessed this old room still held such secrets? It is said, said that the geoglyphs appeared all over Hyrule during the upheaval when Princess Zelda went missing. Hmm. How are they connected to these image? Oh. There is no time to dwaddle. Let us hurry and investigate the remaining geoglyph. Mm. Oh, Lady Emperor, perhaps you should rest a bit before such, such, for such a trying journey. Oh. Link, if you happen to see a geoglyph during your travels, I urge you to investigate this matter as well. If more strange visions are waiting at the other geoglyph, just like the one you already experienced, well. Perhaps they will provide clues that could lead us to Princess Zelda. And my geoglyphs begin. So the next one she said is at Rio Village. Or close to Rio Village. Yeah. I see. Let's go here, jump out. Start the collection. Oh, right there, that's the gear blue. Okay. Now we gotta find it here in the geoglyph. I actually think this is it right here. Yeah, it's this one right here. Right here? That was it. All right, y'all, story time. Get more understanding of what's going on. As I thought, this is not the world I know. A time so far back in the past, it's become legend. So it's true. This is really the era of Hyrule's founding? Your presence here is just as strange to us, Zelda. But if you, like Sonya, have a secret stone, 
and are able to manipulate time, then your story makes sense. Oh? I believed her right away. You needed the secret stone as proof, Raru? I can feel your light power within her, as well as my time power. Additionally, I sense that we share a blood connection. Ah, uh, I see. In any case, Zelda, you had said that you needed to return to your era as soon as you possibly could. Yes. In my time, something terrible is happening. I need to get back there, but how do I do that? I don't even know how I got here in the first place. <laughs> Now, Zelda, dear, you don't need to solve your problems all at once. Why not come back with us to the castle, hmm? No, I... We'll tell everyone that you're a distant relative of ours. <laughs> it is true, after all. <laughs> we'll get you fresh clothes, too. Oh. I'm sure an answer will come to you. Wisdom takes time. I don't know what to say. Hmm, I wonder. Minoru, she may have some idea of how to get you back to your era. Minoru, you said? Yes. She knows far more than anyone about our people. And like us, my older sister has a secret stone. We'll call on her. Okay. So we got that memory. Oh shit, I'm freezing. I'm freezing. I'm freezing. See, we gotta do this in order. Because if we don't do this in order, I'll risk spoiling something. All right. So that one's supposed to be the next one. So then we gonna go over here. Okay, we gotta go this way. Right there. The Nintendo Switch. I believe that's the next one. So this, where is it at? Oh, I think I see it. I think it's right here. Boy, that was like a glove. I ain't never seen one. It is quite an interesting device. This is definitely not from this era. That said, I believe there may be a way to get the travel functionality working here. I'd like to tinker with it a bit, 
Would it be okay if I borrow it? Yes. Whatever you need. I really appreciate your help. Then I'll hold on to it. So you really believe my story? That I came from the future? I never doubted you for a moment. Minoru, do you know of a way we could help to return Zelda back to her time? I suspect it was the power of your secret stone that allowed you to travel through time. To put it simply, secret stones amplify the power their owners possess. I am able to separate my spirit from my body. Hmm. Raru can repel or destroy evil with his power of light. And Sonia, she can control time. As for you, I can sense both light and time powers. Mm. She gets both. But your secret stone seems to amplify your time power. Time power? Ultimately, the secret stone only amplifies your power. It doesn't suddenly grant you mastery and control. That's still up to you. That means, if you don't already know how to get yourself home... <sighs> there are stories about the secret stones and a forbidden act called Draconification. To swallow a secret stone is to become an immortal dragon. One blessed with eternal life. <gasps> Interesting. Another way to reach the future, though not a very quick one. So you think these stories could hint at a solution to our dilemma? Yes. But there is still more to those tales. To become an immortal dragon is to lose oneself. That is why it is forbidden. I thought maybe this could lead to a solution, some way to transcend time. But if you have to sacrifice your heart and mind, sacrifice what makes you, you. I'm sorry. I wish I could help more. <sighs> oh, back where we started. <clears throat> There's still hope. I think the answer, the answer to this problem lies in study and learning more about the nature of your power. I'm sure Sonya would be happy to help you. <sighs> okay. So, uh, that right there pretty much confirms what I thought it was. Pretty much confirms a couple things that's going on. So I don't I don't want to say too much till we get to the point, but that really confirms exactly what's kind of going on. I think it's this one. Mm -hmm. but yeah I, I i i know i know exactly what's going on or more of a better term i know what happens to zelda i should say All right, let's go to the next memory. Nice, this one's pretty close. We need to go. So I don't even see it. Yeah, I don't see it. Hold on. 
need to find it. Oh, I see it. Gandorf. Hyrule will bow down before me. Try me. Wait. <laughs> Wrong enemy. So brute force will not be enough. The secret stone of the Zonai. <laughs> How interesting. Fucking using tri beams and shit. Okay, so that was four. Ooh, wait, one, two, three, four, five. Well, this should be five. Well, it should be five. Cause I'm not trying to yeah see so far we been in going in order so, I want to keep going in order this one it's weird. yeah this this part's gonna be story heavy. He'll bring her. Let's 
So now where is it at on here? Unless I sit right there. No, not that one. Oh, no, it is this one right here. Made a splash. to offer you my deepest apologies on behalf of the Gerudo for taking so long to accept your repeated invitations. It is our desire to be accepted into the protective embrace of your kingdom to serve it faithfully. Oh, A welcome appeal, Ganondorf. I will accept your vow of fealty to the kingdom of Hyrule. I understand that a single male is born to the Gerudo every 100 years. Receiving such an appeal from you, a hero to his people and a king by birth, well, it is truly reassuring. It is my honor. When your Zonai ancestors first descended upon these lands long, long ago, they must have seemed to be gods. And now you rule as king, and have taken a Hyrulean woman as your wife. <clears throat> your majesty has certainly risen above your admirable lineage. Most impressive. Hmm. It is unfortunate that the noble Zonai no longer grace this world with their presence. Interesting. All except you and your sister, that is. Even if something were to happen to me, both my kingdom and the peace it brings, these will endure for generations to come. <laughs> your actions today are appreciated, Ganondorf. I look forward to your future endeavors. You may leave. Your Majesty. Yeah, don't trust him. King Roru, I believe that man's heart holds many dark ambitions. Just his name, even that, it gives me pause. I am well aware of his evil nature. For that reason, and others, I want him close. It will be easier to keep an eye on him. There is nothing to worry about. Okay. Nothing to be worried about. My lies, my lies. I think you should be worried. Worried and stayed worried. <laughs> but, I mean, it makes sense though. You do want him close to you to see exactly what he's doing. But are you prepared for it though? Well, that is the question. I think this will be close. Are you prepared?
What she needs, can we make it over there? Might have to glide a little bit. this tier. Where is this one? Uh, oh, I see it. Rewind. Are you well? You seem a bit distracted. I apologize. I keep getting lost in my thoughts, thinking about how I can return home. With your power over time, if I were able to learn that kind of control, I might be one step closer to my era. I see. The secret is to think of it like drawing out the object's memory. You ask the object where it was, how it arrived where it is now, and then you coax it back to that original moment in time. The object's memory? I'm sure it will become almost like second nature, and you will be able to find your way home. But Zelda, there is more on your mind than just that. You, of course, do want to get back to your time. But you also desperately want to help us out in this era. Am I close to the truth? How did you know? <laughs> I do not believe it is possible to keep anything secret from Sonya. <laughs> oh, your concern is very sweet, Zelda. But listen, you can focus your attention on returning home. After all, you possess more than power over time. You have a sacred power that can dispel evil. Both of these powers will help you protect your own era. Queen Sonia! And of course, you must make it home safe to put Link's mind at ease. Link? Uh, that is not a name I have heard. He is a royal knight. He had been originally appointed for my protection. 
But later, he became a hero by saving both me and Hyrule from a great evil. Oh, a hero is he? He is so very dedicated, and he refuses to back down from any challenge. Fuck well, yeah. Uh, he is very strong. <laughs> and his heart is good and true. Ah, uh, I can see that you have absolute faith in him. Hearing you speak so highly of Link, I find myself wanting to meet him as well. Indeed. I would also like to meet him. He must be quite the brave, courageous knight. What a picture Zelda paints of him. <laughs> <laughs> Tea time. <gasps> Onward to the next memory. Hey, hey. Goodbye. Hey, the dragon. We're going over here to the blade. To the sword. Oh, I think I see where I'm serious. Yeah, I think that's the tier. Can I make it? Oh, this, this is where the tear is. Ah, like a glove. Zelda, we are alone as you requested. What was it you wanted to discuss with me in private? <laughs> you are far too trusting. <laughs> oh my. I'm surprised to hear you say such a thing. Nope. That is quite out of character for the Zelda I know. But then you are a puppet of Ganondorf. Did you really think we hadn't realized your deceit? <laughs> oh, you should have let that shit slice. <laughs> well, that bitch just disappeared. Oh, shit. Uh, 
That motherfucker stealth killed your ass. God damn. Fucking smile, oh my god. <laughs> it don't like don't be suspicious, don't be suspicious. <laughs> Straight up Judah punched the shit out of her. God damn. <laughs> Uh, are we still in order? Yes, we're still in order. Damn. Ganondorf ain't fucking around. We need to... Don't be suspicious. Don't be suspicious. Yeah. <laughs> I think the shit just got real. It's that one right there. Let me see. Hmm? Can I see the two? <laughs> Trying to see if I can see the two. Yeah, let's go. Oh, right here. It is mine. Oh, he made that shit black. He tainted that shit like a sacred jewel. You need to uh, get up out of there. Oh, he transformed. Yeah, I think it's time for you to get up out of there, Zelda.
So until he has that sacred stone, he can do the blood. Yeah, that was kind of crazy. Which one's closer? This one should be closer. Oh, shit. Let's try this one. So now that again door. Yeah, everyone's fucked. We are all fucked. I believe that's where our destination's taking us. Hold on, let me eat something because I'm losing. Ever that I need to cook, I need to cook some shit. I see the tears from all the way up here. Be line to the T. Be line to the T.
King Raru. We just received word that the last free village in the Gerudo Desert has fallen. <sighs> At this rate, the Demon King's army will overwhelm us. I understand. Our only hope is for me to defeat the Demon King. Raru. The Demon King. He is not someone you can stop by yourself. But, you are not alone. You have the Gerudo, <laughs> Goron, Zora, and Rito leaders, as well as Zelda. And of course, you can count on me. There's something I'd like to show you all. More sacred stones. Sacred stones. Stand with me. I need all your aid. Kill the King of Darkness. <laughs> okay, so if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, we're missing a couple, which is fine. I think it's I gotta do a couple events to get that one. But I wanna get all these tears because I want to get the Master Sword. So... Now this one... I don't even know which one to go to. Let's go here. Actually, this is a fail. <laughs> um, fuck it. Keep it going. Oh. 
way right there. Okay. Let's see, what is that? Okay, we don't have to explore uh, some of these islands. I thought I was gonna let you hit me. Alright, so where is this one at? What? I think I see it. be able to make it. We got this shit on the side of the wall. Sonia. Oh, Zelda. King Raru, before you face the Demon King tomorrow, there is something I must tell you. I came, I came to this era, after finding a man underground. Hmm. Go on. When I witnessed what the secret stone did to Ganondorf, at that moment, I knew for sure, what we found underground, that was him. He was still alive, still powerful. He continues to live on, all the way until my time. In tomorrow's battle, we won't be able to defeat him. No matter how strong we think we are, he'll survive. And you... And you will... Maybe so. But it is my duty to try. It was my hubris that set us on this path. I must atone for my error in judgment. And above all else, I remain the King of Hyrule. As with any leader, it is my duty to safeguard and protect my people, even if I must risk my life. And if it proves impossible for us to defeat Ganondorf, we rely on your knight and that legendary sword he carries. 
Our last line of defense will be Link. But remember, that was a future where you never appeared in this world. And you are here now. Zelda, I believe there is a reason you were sent to us. It has to mean something. Yeah, and it means that she's telling you what the fuck to do and not to do. The reason I am here. I mean, she's telling you what happens in the, in the future or in the present. Or what happened in the past. The fact that what y'all do in the past didn't do nothing. Because we still seeing the effects in the future. Or the present. Time. <laughs> Time. Alright, I believe this is the last dragon tier. This is the last. Time is such a fe um, time is such a fecal thing. Fecally. Fecally. Freakily. <laughs> Finicky. There it is. Such a finicky subject. Well, there's our last one. So where's the tear? Oh, I think it's right there at the tip. Star fragment. Yeah, right there at the tip. Managed to restrain him somehow. Okay, I remember seeing. But Link, I am not sure you'll be able to stop him. Yep, that happened in the beginning. Oh. 
How is the master's sword? You're telling me that Link is safe? You traveled through time to find me and recover your strength. Zelda, I believe there is a reason you were sent to us. It has to mean something. I know why I am here. It's something only I can do. We will finally stop him. To become an immortal dragon is to lose oneself. I'll be forever changed. <laughs> Link. I knew you it. Must find me. I knew it. <laughs> I knew it. The light dragon. Shit. Hey, we actually got on um, the shrine here. Okay, so these tears. <laughs> I don't want to spoil too much because I know what's going on now. Oh, I know what's going on now. Hopefully this is what's cool. Yeah. Was that the sword that seals the darkness? The blade that shatters so easily against my power cannot save you from me. The sword will continue to gain strength if bathed in sacred power. The stronger that power, the more powerful the sword becomes. After all, you possess more than power over time. You have a sacred power that can dispel evil. To swallow a secret stone is to become an immortal dragon, one blessed with eternal life. Minoru, I'm counting on you. I will 
will restore the master sword for you. I will care for it until the time comes. I will pour my sacred power into it. It will be the weapon that defeats the Demon King. To become an immortal dragon is to lose oneself. But she became a dragon. She really just turned herself into a dragon. So now we gotta get the Master Sword from her. She has the master sword. My uh, silent princess is over here, too. So, yep, that's what I knew from the last time we played was um, we got this one, right? We got Mini Room and her memory kind of hinted at her doing that, becoming that. This is Zelda. Fucking knew it. But it kind of hinted that she was going to become the dragon so that she can repair the Master Sword. So now we got to find a way to get up top because I think that's the Master Sword right there. So we got to find a way to get to the Master Sword. But yeah. 